This is always what I grab when I leave the house. Phone keys, wallet, mask. And as I leave the house, I tend to mumble that to myself. Phone keys, wallet, mask, phone keys, wallet, mask, phone keys, wallet, mask. They are the four things that I don't go anywhere without. The phone I'm using is the iPhone 12 mini, and I really like the size of it. I honestly wouldn't change anything about it. I have no complaints. Within the past year, I started using the MagSafe wallet that goes with this phone, and I also have zero complaints about this. It snaps really nicely to the back of the phone, whether or not you have a case on your phone, and the card holder itself has enough room for three cards. I always carry my driver's license, my health insurance card, and some kind of payment card. When I first got the wallet, it was a bit tight to fit three cards, but now it fits perfectly, and you do need to take the wallet off of your phone in order to use the thumb key on the back, to get the cards out. The phone case I have right now is also from Apple, but I would not at all recommend this phone case. It's the rubberized soft touch one and it's very minimal, but I've been using it for less than a year and it already has two big chips in it. I've been using the same mask since 2020 started. I bought them from Everlane and I don't even know if they're for sale anymore. They're not the most complicated masks, but they've been working and I haven't needed to buy anything new. I currently carry two keys to get into my building along with the key to my van, but I am planning on selling my van soon. So then I'll just be carrying two keys and I'll be able to carry it on this carabiner. Depending on where I'm going, I might carry extra cards with me or cash. I do usually wear jewelry, so this might be considered part of my everyday carry. I have this silver banded bracelet from me inside and it makes me feel fancy. Much less fancy are the five rings that I have. Only one of them has actual quality to it. The other ones are just cheapo and easily replaceable. I'll usually have one of these black hair ties on me. I started carrying a Nalgene water bottle again, so I'll often bring one of these with me. Once in a while, I'll bring a phone charger with me. If I'm planning to record something while I'm out, I might bring my Rode lav mic and this Peak tripod. The lav mic's pretty simple. I have a dongle on it so I could just plug it into my phone. And this mobile tripod I've only had for about a month, but it's really nice quality. It's all metal. There's a ball joint on it that seems really durable. And you can use the tripod either as an L shape or a three leg tripod. It magnetizes to the back of my phone, just like my wallet. If I'm planning to edit at a coffee shop or I'm traveling, I'll usually take my Bose noise canceling headphones. If I'm bringing my laptop somewhere, I'll use this Tumi backpack that has been discontinued or I'll use this purse from Fossil, which also is very old. I really love products like this that get better with age. This is usually where I keep my EDC when I'm not using it, on my bedside table. I love the super minimal, clean look of this charging stand. Not only is it clean and minimal looking, but it also charges everything up so you're ready to go. 